If someone wants to make a change in their life, my favorite area to always start with is the body because it's the way you can figure out if you know how to keep a promise to yourself. What happens when you're capable of keeping a promise to yourself in any area of your life is that you develop that skill to be able to keep it in other areas of your life. When someone wants to work on an area in their life where they're stuck, the reason they're stuck is either they can't dream or they don't believe in themselves. And then the only way they can dream or believe in themselves is if they take those actions that they're either scared to take or they don't know why they can't take them. So we help them design the vision and deal with taking the actions daily, right? And the support of helping someone take those actions is remarkable. It's the difference between making something happen in their life or never seeing that dream come true. And then there is nothing better than teaching someone not to wait till they're in the mood to make a change. If there's a dream you don't already have and you're not taking your actions to get there, then the mood that you live in about that is your problem. And that's what you need to go after and fix. Three tips for a New Year's resolution. First, figure out exactly what you wanna do. Number two, tell everybody. Put that on Facebook, tweet it. Do whatever you have to do that you are making an announcement to your community so that you feel accountable. Number three, put in a consequence, right? So tell everyone out there, if I don't lose the 10 pounds in 10 weeks, I'm giving up television for six weeks. Put in a consequence that really will help you keep the promise, right? So the best thing to do for a New Year's resolution is tell everybody, make sure you're clear, and, and come up with a consequence that is good for you but still going to make you deal with it. There's nothing more important than being a dreamer. I break life out into 18 different areas on purpose so that you literally design your life. You invent that dream and then your life is about fulfilling on that and chasing your dreams. And then what I have always found in young people is that they don't know they can dream big, right? They, you know, some people dream big and then everybody else isn't dreaming. If you're willing to dream and chase your dream, they will come true. That's what this is all about. Even it might take 20 years, but it's worth it and you're worth it.